Ever made a travel mistake that ruined your trip? We've all been there, haven't we? The excitement of venturing into the unknown, the thrill of discovery, only to be dampened by some unforeseen hiccup. Traveling can be a wonderful, enriching experience, but it can also be fraught with pitfalls if we're not careful. So what are some common travel blunders people tend to make? Stay tuned as we delve into some of the most common travel mistakes and how to avoid them. Jumping headfirst into a new place might sound adventurous, but it can lead to unnecessary problems. Picture this, you're on a tropical beach, but you've only packed sweaters, or you're in a bustling city, but have no idea where to find the nearest pharmacy. These are the kinds of challenges you could face if you don't research your destination beforehand. Knowing about the local customs, weather, and important locations can save you from a lot of trouble. For instance, understanding the local customs can prevent potential cultural faux pas. Being aware of the weather can help you pack appropriately. And knowing the important locations can make your navigation easier and safer. The consequences of not researching can range from minor inconveniences to major mishaps. You could end up offending locals, getting lost, or being unprepared for the weather conditions. So before you embark on your journey, take some time to do a little homework about your destination. Remember, knowledge is power, especially when you're in a new place. Scene script. Have you ever struggled with a heavy suitcase in a foreign land? Picture this. You're dragging a bag that feels like it's filled with bricks, breaking a sweat as you navigate foreign streets and juggling excess baggage fees. Sound familiar? This, my friends, is the pitfall of overpacking. Overpacking not only weighs you down physically, but it also burdens your travel experience. It limits your mobility, adds unnecessary costs, and steals away from the spontaneity of travel. Instead, let's talk about packing light and effectively. First, consider your destination's climate and culture to determine essential clothing. Pack versatile pieces that can be mixed and matched. Second, remember that less is more. Do you really need five pairs of shoes for a week-long trip? Probably not. And finally, roll your clothes or use packing cubes to save space. You'll be amazed by how much you can fit into a small suitcase. Packing light gives you freedom and flexibility, two essentials for a great travel experience. While having a plan is good, sticking to it rigidly can rob you of spontaneous fun. This is especially true when you're traveling. A detailed itinerary can certainly help you manage your time and ensure you don't miss out on key attractions. However, it's equally important to leave some wiggle room for unexpected experiences. Imagine walking past a lively local market or stumbling upon a music festival that wasn't part of your original plan. If you're too tied to your itinerary, you might miss out on these unique, spontaneous experiences that often become the highlights of any trip. Being flexible doesn't mean you have to abandon your plans completely. It simply suggests a balance between structure and spontaneity. You may have a list of must-see places, but also be open to the unexpected. Allow yourself to explore, to wander, to discover. Remember, sometimes the best travel experiences come from unplanned adventures. Embrace the unknown and let your journey surprise you. When in Rome, do as the Romans do. A catchy phrase, isn't it? But it holds a profound truth that every traveler should heed. Ignoring local customs and traditions can lead to unintentional disrespect and awkward situations. Let's consider Japan, a country with a rich tapestry of tradition and etiquette. Here, it's common for people to bow when greeting each other. A simple handshake, which is a customary greeting in many Western countries, might be perceived as impolite. Then there's Thailand a country known for its warmth and hospitality. But did you know that touching someone's head even in a friendly manner is considered disrespectful? The head is viewed as the most sacred part of the body in Thai culture. And let's not forget about the Middle East where certain hand gestures that might seem harmless to you could be offensive. For instance, a thumbs up, a typical sign of approval in many countries, is seen as a vulgar gesture in some parts of this region. How about Italy? Ah, the land of pasta and wine. But beware, Ordering a cappuccino after a meal might earn you some raised eyebrows. Italians traditionally enjoy this frothy coffee as a breakfast drink and not after a meal. Now these are just a few examples. Each country, each region, even each city has its own unique set of customs and traditions. Ignoring these can lead to misunderstandings and can even land you in trouble. But more than that, it robs you of the opportunity to truly immerse yourself in a new culture. Respecting local customs is not about being overly cautious or walking on eggshells. It's about understanding and appreciating the rich diversity of our world. It's about fostering mutual respect and creating meaningful connections. So, research ahead, learn about the customs, and when you're there, observe and follow. It's not just about avoiding faux pas. It's about embracing the local culture, understanding their values, and enriching your own world perspective. 
Respecting local customs not only prevents uncomfortable situations, but also enriches your travel experience. Travel insurance might seem like an unnecessary expense until it's not. Picture this. You're on the adventure of a lifetime exploring the bustling streets of an exotic foreign city when suddenly you twist your ankle. Or worse, you lose your passport or your luggage goes missing. These unforeseen events can turn your dream vacation into a nightmare. That's where travel insurance comes in. It's not just about health coverage. It's a safety net that can cover unexpected incidents like trip cancellations, loss or theft of personal belongings, and even emergency evacuations. It can also provide support services, like assistance with replacing lost travel documents. It's easy to think, it won't happen to me, but the truth is, it can happen to anyone. So before you embark on your next journey, consider investing in travel insurance. Because sometimes, it's the unplanned moments that end up costing the most. Travel insurance is not a luxury, it's a necessity. So, let's quickly recap the common travel mistakes we've discussed today. Firstly, we delved into the pitfalls of not researching the destination. It's not just about knowing the best spots to visit, it's about understanding the safety guidelines, local laws, and the general vibe of the place. It's about knowing what to expect and preparing accordingly. Remember, knowledge is the key to a smooth travel experience. Next, we discuss the all too common blunder of overpacking. Lugging around a massive suitcase filled with just-in-case items can be a real mood killer. We need to master the art of packing light, bringing only the essentials, and leaving space for the inevitable souvenirs and mementos that we'll acquire along the journey. Moving on, we highlighted the importance of having a flexible itinerary. While it's crucial to have a plan, it's equally important to leave room for spontaneity, embrace the unexpected, allow for changes, and understand that sometimes the best moments come from unplanned adventures. We also talked about ignoring local customs, a mistake that can potentially lead to awkward or even offensive situations. Respecting the local culture, traditions, and customs is not just a sign of good manners, it's a way of immersing ourselves in the experience of truly connecting with the place and its people. And finally, we stress the significance of having travel insurance. It's one of those things you hope you never have to use, but you'll be grateful for if the need arises. From lost luggage to medical emergencies, travel insurance can be a lifesaver. In all this, let's not forget the underlying message. These aren't rules set in stone, but guidelines to help you navigate the exciting world of travel. The goal isn't to scare you away from making mistakes, but to help you avoid the common ones, so you can make room for your own unique experiences. The beauty of travel lies in the unknown, the surprises, the learning, and yes, even the mistakes. But by being aware of these common pitfalls, you can focus less on avoiding blunders and more on creating unforgettable memories. Remember, the goal is to learn from these mistakes, not to be afraid of making them. Happy travels. Before we wrap up, we have a small request for our viewers. If you found this video helpful and want more content like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Join our travel savvy community and be the first to get our latest travel tips and guides we're here to help you navigate the world with confidence and ease. And remember, every journey is an adventure filled with lessons and memories. Safe travels, everyone. And we can't wait to be a part of your next adventure. See you on the other side.